Most of my community is low income. A lot of the parents in that area are first generation immigrants. There was a lot of violence. I lived a block away from my elementary school. My mom even had to walk me to school because she was so worried. I had no idea what it meant to go to college or to have the aspirations of being in technology or in STEM. We just didn't know that was available. STEM education is so important for girls because of the economic opportunity that is at the end of the road for them. 15% of girls 5 through 17 live in poverty in the U.S. and STEM industries are the fastest growing industry and jobs in our country. The mission of TechBridge Girls is to excite, educate, and equip girls to really see STEM as their vehicle to greater and better opportunities for their life. And we do this in really two ways. We provide high quality after school programs to girls in low income communities. And we train educators so that they can retain, recruit, and engage girls more effectively. When we can provide them great hands-on activities, role models that engage and inspire them, connections to industry, we find that our girls leave with a whole new proud identity that they can be a contributor to the STEM innovation of our world. The first moment that I stepped into the classroom with TechBridge Girls, I knew I wanted to be part of that community. It felt surreal to have other black and brown girls who are doing science projects. And after I had got that exposure from TechBridge and I learned that going into STEM was fun, I knew that that was the path I wanted to pursue. TechBridge Girls Hope for the Future is about seeing every girl have the opportunity and access to a quality STEM education. I am positive that I wouldn't have the career that I have today if it weren't for TechBridge Girls motivating me and exciting me. I'm currently an IT analyst and I absolutely love it. I know the possibilities are limitless in this career, but my long-term dreams are really to continue changing the world and influence one girl at a time.